It is the first Friday night in three months. People can sit at a bar and dine at a restaurant in the city of Milwaukee. Katie Crowther is live on Old World 3rd Street. Yeah, Charles, I want to get out of the shot so you can see how it looks here on Old World 3rd Street. Many people, as you know, have criticized the city's decision to reopen restaurants and bars today to in-person service again. Many restaurants have decided to stay closed. Their owners citing COVID-19 still a threat or that they weren't given enough notice about reopening. But most of the bars here along Old World 3rd Street are back open and people are showing up was super excited and wasn't going to miss it for the world. A lot of people enjoying Milwaukee Broadhouse House in person. The bar and outside tables nearly full. Olivia and Ella deciding to have a girls night out. You wouldn't think that just going to a restaurant would be so out of the norm, but I mean, as we were just talking, it's been like two months since we've been able to sit down and enjoy a meal at a restaurant, so it's it's almost like a new experience. I was really surprised by how much I craved this kind of normalcy. To have some semblance of a normal amidst all the craziness definitely feels better. Capacity is limited to 25%. At the Broad House, a hand sanitizing station greets you at the door and all employees are wearing masks. Yeah, I feel very safe. I definitely feel safe. I don't feel at risk at, at, like, at all. You have to be cautious of what's going on with the whole pandemic, but at the same time, you want to be able to live your life. So you need to take the necessary precautions, but also have fun. And just down the street at the bar Red, White and Blue, there are red markings on the sidewalk measuring six feet of distance outside the main door. That's because they're expecting crowds, a line to form potentially. So restaurants are taking precautions. Reporting from Old World 3rd Street, Katie Crowther, TMJ4 News.